we need to create a store procedure uh, to add up the record to create a store procedure what we need to do we need to go to our server explorer and we need to select our database I'm right now I'm using my ata.mtf database so so here my store procedure is there so to add a new store procedure just right click on this just say add new store procedure let's give this nice name that is usp add customer let's write the two store uh, two commands together that is add and update so i will say add update customer so let's uncomment this let's check the fields what we have we have the customer name and customer address and customer id so let's create a parameter that is customer id int equal to 10 customer name where can find it comma customer address that is where care find it let's write the SQL command as I told you uh, store procedures are a pre-compiled code we can write a multiple command in a store procedure so I will show you how to write a multiple command so let's assume that if the customer ID is empty let's write a condition here if if our customer ID that is customer ID is equal to 0 then let's write the insert query insert into customer that is customer name comma customer address values that is else let's do the update if the customer ID is not equal to 0 else do the update say begin let's end this else begin and end update customer set customer name is equal to comma Cust customer address is equal to customer address where customer underscore id is equal to yes oops i think i forgot to add the round braces here so let me add the 
round braces and oh this take out one equal to sign now let's save this yes now we uh, we have created a store procedure to add and update the customer that uh, if the customer id is equal to zero then it will go and add the new record into the customer table and if the customer id is equal not equal to zero means it it is greater than zero then it will simply go and update the customer database so this is how our store procedures look like